Um, started with a march, Strathspey and Reel there. Um, Donald McLean's Farewell to Oban, the Pipe March, followed by two tunes by James Scott Skinner, Forbes Morrison, and Gladstone to finish. I'm um, going to play a slow air now. This was written by a fiddler fae for the Highlands, called Donald Riddle, um, a former member of the Lovett Scouts. Um, this tune is called The Lament for King George V, and it was composed by Donald after having been a piper that played at King George's funeral. very much. Um, well, we're going to have a song now. My lovely wife Shona's come along to sing someone for you. So ladies and gentlemen, Shona Donaldson. Thanks very much. Um, so I'm going to do one song for you. This is a ballad from the northeast of Scotland, a song called The Burning of Ochendoon, or sometimes known as Willie Mackintosh. And uh, it's all about a uh, a clan feud between the Gordons and the Forbuses in the 16th century. So this is the burning of Ochendun. <clears throat> As I come in by the day side on the morning, I spied a Willie Macintosh 
So fair suits the acoustics in here, beautiful. Um, well, I'm going to finish up with a set of tunes, starting with a, a jig I composed myself. It's called the, the Return to Kincraigie, which is about, well, basically for a bide. It means a Kincraigie just outside Tarland. Um, that's followed by an old tune for the 18th century called The Sailor's Wife. And then you could probably argue one of Scotland's best Kent reels, The Deal Among the Tailors to Finish. Um, I've enjoyed playing for you folks. Thanks very much. We look forward to seeing you live one of these days further down the line. Thank you. 